Today on Brew Review, we have the 1150 Brew IPA by Greenpoint Beer and Ale Company. This is a dry hopped brew IPA coming up next. Welcome to Brew Review, I'm Brady. And I'm Corey. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe, ding the bell to be notified of all the fresh brewed content coming your way. We got some brewed IPA. It's gonna be uh, nice and dry, hopefully. Greenpoint is based out of Manhattan. It's called 1150 Brewed IPA because I believe that is their address, 1150 Manhattan Avenue. I don't really mess with a lot of brewed IPAs. I mess with a lot of dry hopped IPAs, but brew? I've only had a handful. They're, they're hit or miss for me. I'm, I, I like a lot of brewed IPAs. I love dry beers. I love dry uh, wine, but you know, sometimes they're a little too much with the hops. Much like your sense of humor. Yeah, it's very dry. This beer is coming in at 6.8% ABV. Couldn't find the IBUs on this one, but... I'm sure they're high. I'm sure it's up there. Yeah. Thank you to Clinton Gourmet Corp for sending us this beer. This review would not be possible without you. Thank you very much. Let's go ahead and take a look at this can. Nice orangish golden background, brown. You're not gonna be able to tell by our picture, but it is 1150, just very large wrapped around the can. It's a little abstract. Very modern looking. And then right on the side, you have their 1150 Brewed IPA, and you have their logo, Greenpoint. Let's assess this. Let's assess this. Very pale, hazy, kind of hay-like. Not what I was expecting it to yeah, look like. Yeah, this reminds me of like a Saison almost. Pretty pale for an IPA. Oh, absolutely, for an IPA, it's insanely pale. There's some light lacing on this, and it's sticking a little bit. I think it was about a finger's worth of head. Finger's worth of yeah. head. But it quickly went away. Let's waft it. I'm getting the dry hop. A blueberry and violet. But this does smell like straight up, picked the flower right in front of the front door, went up to your prom date and gave it to her. Yeah, that, that hop is very overpowering. Let's taste it. Let's around. taste it. Cheers. Cheers. That's bitter. It is pretty bitter. Reminds me of like picking a Pinot Noir grape off the vine and just kind of munching on it and that you got the crunching on the seeds and you know, got the tannins going on. It seems that like maybe slightly medicinal to me. That floral aspect, it's almost coming across as like diesel on the on the mouth. Some petrol? Yeah, I'm just gonna say diesel. Some petrol. <laughs> and the way a sour attacks the you know the back of your jaw, and this is really doing the same thing, but in like a, a bitterness aspect. To me, it's not an easy drinker at all. It's just a bit too much. Well, this has like a Negroni bitterness. Last brewed IP I had like was more of a champagne like, and this yeah. is really it's kind of intense. Ultra super dry, man. Mm -hmm. It's like you want to drink more, but it just ends up drying you out more. Yeah, light body though. Very light bodied. It's not yeah. quenching me. Mm -mm. I need to have a water to go along with this. I need to have a beer. For my beer? For my beer. <laughs> dry diesel dank. Dank, dry diesel. I think it's well made. I think it's just overpowering with the dank and the diesel. Mm -hmm. It's very dry, it's not quenching me. Like we said, we had to, we want to get a beer for our beer. I think I'm gonna give this a 3.4 out of five. 3.4? Yeah, I, you know, I think that's a very fair assessment, man. It's it definitely is, as far as you know, dry IPAs, it's definitely on the far right for it being insanely dry and super bitter. I would I would say uh, probably 3.5 for me. Yeah. It's very good though. I mean, as it's far good. as flavor, you know, execution of style, like everything was dead on. So that was our review of the 1150 Brew IPA by Greenpoint Beer and Ale Company out of Manhattan. If you liked what you saw, please give us a like, subscribe, and ding the bell to be notified of all the new content coming your way. What's your favorite brewed IPA? Have you had this one? What did you think? Let us know in the comments below. And until next time, cheers. cheers.